Hey, it's Computer World here with a look at the Monstroid 2 multi-purpose website template. A few months ago, Template Monster released the Monstroid 2 WordPress theme, which is GPL 3.0, which means that you can use that theme on any project that you have as a web developer. And Monstroid 2 is a flagship theme. Now, the other day I was looking for ways to update the Monstroid 2 WordPress theme, and I clicked on the Monstroid 2 multi-purpose website template, not paying attention. So, I noticed on the Monstroid, Monstroid 2 demo, and I'm going to show you here. Now, this whole time, I was not paying attention to the theme number. I was thinking that this was the WordPress um, version of Monstroid 2. Because once I saw the builder, I was like, yes, this is it. So, this is the Monstroid Squared or Monstroid 2 HTML demo. And if you look at this demo, it is sleek. That's why you have the power of being able to code. I'm with the drag and drop editor. Don't get me wrong. Even the drag and drop editors that have been incorporated into WordPress. But, to me, you know, if you're a developer, being able to code and know HTML, CSS, PHP, um, JavaScript, all those things have an advantage because you're able to take um, your designs to another level. So that is the, like, the pro to being a developer. That's the advantage of being a developer. Now, I'm going to show you, this is the live demo. Uh, well, that was the live demo there, but this is what they have to offer. The thing I want to point out is the Novi Builder. Now, these layouts that you see here are similar to what you would see in the WordPress theme. But the thing that stuck out to me was the Novi Builder. And so I'm going to just get back to the Novi Builder and get right into it because this is what I want to show you. Now, you have builders like Divi. You have Viva Builder. You have, um, what's the new one? There's another one that's called uh, Oxygen App. That's a good one. So what the Novi Builder is, is it allows you to edit on the front end a HTML theme. In other words, you upload those files to uh, your web server via FileZilla, and then you're able to, you know, go in and edit, you know, your HTML files. Well, with this, you're able to do a front end development. So if you are a coder, somebody that's hardcore, you have access to the HTML um, code, the CSS code, and the JavaScript code. So if you're a hardcore programmer, you're able to um, go into and get your geek on. You're able to go in and change anything in here that you want to change. And it gives you an error to let you know, hey, you didn't put the syntax right. You need to close out a statement. But for those of you who are afraid of coding, or those of you who are learning to code, you can go into the design element. So you're able to go into here. I'm still in edit, but you're able to go in and change, you know, the wording. If you have a button, I'm just going to put by features. You're able to do that. But on the design aspect of it, you're able to go in and say, if you want to change the color of this button, add a link. Let's see if I can go in and ch actually change the color. Because I'm doing this right off the top of my head because I saw it. But I'm pretty sure that you can go in and do that. I wasn't able to go in after searching and try to see how I can change the color of the button or the hover on the... Um, design aspect of this, but on the coding end, I can go in and see what class it is. Let me close out of here. So this is the button I want to go in. I'm going to click the class. And so earlier, it highlighted the button that was on. So I need to go to button, button, uh, gray base. So if I can, uh, find this in here. Button. Button. Let's try it. 
try gray. Okay. Okay, so I'm having a hard time even finding it. But the whole notion of this video is to show you the power of the Novi Builder created by Template Monster. Just the different options that you have. If you are familiar with any of the other types of, you know, builders that are out there, this kind of reminds me of Oxygen App and how it looks that you're able to drop in header content, uh, your footer, and things like that. Now, this is on the HTML aspect of it, and I love that because me as a geek, I love to code, but I also like to use WordPress, and I do from time to time like to use tools like Divi, Monstroid 2, where it makes the job easier, but for those sophisticated projects, I'm still able to know uh, what I'm doing as far as if I want to add any code to it. So, this is my thing. Tip it, Monster, if you are listening to me, please incorporate the Novi Builder into, hopefully, the WordPress theme, since the license for the WordPress theme is GPL, meaning I can use it on any project, that means any free updates that come up, I'll be able to use uh, those features because it's GPL. Please, I beg you, add the Novi Builder or some sort of, some type of front-end editor for your uh, Monstroid 2, because now you have Similar to Divi, you're able to, well, previous versions of Divi, you're now able to uh, edit on the back end, but the front end on uh, Divi, you're able to do so. If you can incorporate something similar like this on your WordPress theme, you have a home run. This is awesome. Yes, I know there are others out, but I do enjoy using Template Monsters um, products. They didn't pay me to make this or anything. This is just me being honest. And once I saw this, I fell for it because, number one, I was going to bite the bullet on buying Oxygen app or the Oxygen uh, plug-in. But as a designer, as a developer, sometimes you have to use various tools. But for me, this is what would uh, pretty much keep me using my Stroid too. My website, spiritscomputerworld.com, I created it with the Monstroid 2 template. I've had times where I wanted to switch over to various other things. But I think that if they can incorporate the Novi Builder into the WordPress thing, they'll probably keep me and I won't use anything else because I like the way that this works. I like the way that the Monstroid 2 WordPress thing works too. And that's not a knock on Divi. I've enjoyed using Divi. I've enjoyed uh, trying out Oxygen app and others, but I am here to tell you that this Novi Builder, in my opinion, it's not necessarily like just a, a, a you know a game changer because of course the others are doing it, but for me, having put my hands on the various types of drag and drop builders, that this for me would be one that I would love to use on my clients' projects and on my own projects. So this is Spears Computer World signing out. If you have used the Novi Builder on any other template or on the Monstroid 2 template, be sure to let me know in the comments. As of late, you would be able to purchase this Monstroid 2 HTML template for $49. If you hit that affiliate link in the description, that would be helpful for me. This is Spears Computer World signing out once again.